I misplaced my journal in a cave I was exploring. I'll pay for its return. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, yes, I could do that. Blessing of RK to you for your help. Yes, I could definitely find a journal inside Bloating Man's Grotto. I was just. Just. I was. Ju I was. I was. I was just here. I was right here. I. I'm fine. Dude, we came in here. It was morning. We, it was bloody morning. Okay, that's just weird. That is just completely weird. Yes, it is. <sighs> Let's get back to Falkreath and obviously get a night's sleep before we deliver this book, this journal, to Ronil. I have no idea what's going on with day and night, but I've still got night vision, which means this is like, was it two days now? Okay, this is just very strange. I feel like I entered that cave and it just became That's night. Come on. Perhaps it did. Perhaps it's still under some... Oh! I really am very sorry. Just probably keep the uh, night eye on. This probably means we need to buy another room as well. We'll buy another room. Rent the room again. Pretty sure it's going to be the same damned. Oh, we probably. Actually, no, it's too late. Runa will be asleep. Watch what you're doing. Okay, that wasn't me. That was not me. That was... Why is this cart broken? Why is this cart... Okay, never mind. Journal Runnels. He's probably not going to like the fact that I've read this, so let's not tell him. 17th of Second Seed... It has been a long time since I've written an entry in this journal. I admit with some embarrassment that then that when I pulled it down from the shelf, I nearly choked on the dust that flew. There is little to tell, but did suffer another awful nightmare of the war. I suppose this is an affliction common to many who must see the horrors of war firsthand. Writing about it has already helped me to feel better. 19th of Second Seed. Received a letter from Anders in Whiterun. He's invited me to visit, and I intend to accept... It's been a long time since I was in the city. My only fear is the Thalmor. I've heard that they and their agents are abroad in Skyrim, rooting out worshippers of Talos. I must be sure to keep a low profile. 28th of Second Seed. Returned from my trip to Whiterun to find very few flowers have bloomed here. The rest of Skyrim is covered in the blooms of fiery red and piercing blue, but only a scant few have appeared in or near the town. I'll make it my mission to change that. We could use some flowers to brighten this gloomy place. Perhaps I can get Tekla to help me. Ninth mid-year. Spent most of the day consoling Lord, who received news of his cousin Grimvotter's death. They were quite close as youths, and Lord drank and talked of his childhood memories. It was touching, but bittersweet. Twenty-second of mid-year. A wandering peddler passed through Falkrith today. I purchased a few sticks of incense from him. He was a nice young Nord lad, following in his father's footsteps. I think his name was Valbjorn. A few days later, one of the town's guards spied a pack of carrion birds circling near the road. He found young Valbjorn's cor corpse, victim of a bandit attack. My heart is heavy, and yet I should know better. Life and death, growth and change, the turning of the seasons. These are all aspects of mighty RK. I should not be so affected by the death of one young man, and yet. Twelfth Sun's Height. Travellers pass through town speaking of the land in the grip of the high summer. These are the warmest days of the year in Skyrim, but not in Falkreath. Here, all is mist and fog and rain. Yes, I know that well. It is always cool and damp, and the seasons have little meaning. Solaf asked me about this today. 
He said that in a place of the dead, such as our great cemetery, Arkay's dominion should be absolute. And yet Arkay is also the Lord of Seasons, and this place seems untouched by them. I gave the best answer I could. I explained that Falkreath is indeed a place of great power for Arkay, but he prefers to keep it this way, solemn and grey. Hopefully that was at least partly true, but who can possibly know the mind of a god? Twentieth Sun's Height. Dreams of the war again, but this time something different. I was leading a small band of old Mary battle mages on a mission deep into the heart of Imperial territory. We'd drawn near our target, a supply depot outside of Cheyendal, when the sky suddenly darkened. A great shadow passed over us, and there was a roar so terrible it chilled my blood. Something was flying just overhead, so huge and so dark as to blot out the sun. The dream changed then. I was here in Falkreath, performing a service for someone who had just passed away. Though I do not recall who, from the corner of my eye I saw a stranger approaching. I turned to look, but the shadow came again, and the roar, and then I awoke. Now that I reflect on the dream, I cannot help but wonder, was it a dragon? Why would I dream of such a creature when I have never seen one? It seemed so real at the time, but now the memory is fading. What it means, I cannot say. Probably nothing. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? Probably means all sorts. Everything you read or find in this place means something. On my way. You dreamt about a dragon. I experienced one. We sat for too long. We sat for too long. Oh, I, I, I got another sweet roll for you. Uh, they actually had some in, apparently. At least one in. So we've got a spare. Let's give Runil his journal and pretend like we didn't read it. And uh, hope, hope that this pleases him and wins us favor with the Jarl. I mean, it's got to, right? This has got to be. I mean, we've not done him, him any favors. With Dengir, it was two favors. So maybe it only counts as one. It's, you know. Excuse me, Runil. Goost is responsible for the cemetery here in Falkreath. Your journal suggests you're, you've troubled... Uh, I have your journal. Thank you. It's a collection of regrets that I try not to forget. Here, I promise you this. Okay. Ye yes, yeah. Your, your journal suggests you're troubled about your past. I'm thinking maybe I just don't mention that. Because I don't need to now. Is Inigo praying? Is Inigo pray? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just... Uh, you know... Oh, curiosity is killing me now. But then he's going to know I read his journal. He already knows. He can see the guilt on my face. It's pretty obvious. I'm stood here, slack-jawed, staring at him. <sighs> okay, dude. Your journal suggests you're troubled about your past. Burying the past is much harder than burying remains. I'm... I'm afraid of what you will think of me if I tell you about the things I've done. Yeah, I'm fine. Just trust me. Although I have not practiced in a long time, I was once a wizard. Even when I was young, my magic was undeniably powerful. It was that power that brought me to the attention of the Thalmor. In the Somerset Isles, it is a great honor to be chosen to serve the Thalmor. Okay. The Thalmor. I'm going to pretend I don't know what they are. They are the governing council of the Aldmeri Dominion. They led us to attack the Empire and forced the Empire to agree to stop worshipping Talos. It was during the war with the Empire that I was at the height of my power. As a Thalmor battle mage, I laid waste the enemy. Men, women, children. No one was spared my wrath. I destroyed whole villages. So don't mess with you is what you're saying, right? And you're afraid everyone's going to find out. I dream about those days still. Except I'm not me. I can see myself there and I try to stop what I know is going to happen, but... Many of the Empire's troops were Nords at that point. Some of them could even have been from around here. Your secret is safe with me. Yes, your secret is safe with me, but just remember, 
you know, that I did you this favor, yes? Thank you. May R.K. bless you. I won't forget this. Excellent. Brilliant. Yes. Nice. A most pleasant chat. Until the next. Hmm. See? Oh, we now have a friend over. here. R.K.'s blessing upon A friend you. we have some dirt on. Although a friend who could probably blast us to oblivion, so let's not necessarily dwell on the dirt aspect so much. And instead, run off to Jarl No Crown and give him the great news. Everybody loves me. I've been doing so many wonderful things. Hello, Jarl Sidgir. How are you? I'm a steward here. I serve under Jarl Sidgir and Jarl Dengir before him. I know, we've Good to met. see you. Finally, someone useful is around. It's true, isn't it? Good to see you. I've helped your people. I really, really have. Then by my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Falkreath. Congratulations. Yes! I grant you a personal house, Carl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble now. Oh, I never tire of hearing that. The Blade of Falkreath. Thank you very much. Farewell. I have a... With Falkreath and I, this is just one more war in a long line. Yes, yes, war, bad, Why terrible. Not come in from Inigo, we have a house call. I'm now a thing. We have a house call. We don't technically have a house. We've got a plot of land. Should I assume the house car will be waiting for us there? Should we... Yeah, let's go. Let's go check that. Let's go check the land. Oh, God. What was, what was the best way? Go round or across past the... We can... Oh, no, no, no. Actually, even if we do, if we go around, we have to sort of hop up here past the necromancer. It's probably actually better to go this way. We... It's a tough choice, really, isn't it? Ride past the necromancer or the rocks. <sighs> the, those rocks terrify me almost more, I think. Okay, so it's close to here, right? I believe. Mud crab. Nern root. Wasn't it? Hi okay, it is, in fact, here. This is Lakeview Manor. I don't see... I don't see a house call. He did say he would give me a house call, yes? He said I would... Oh, God, do I actually have to have a house before ha Mr. Dragonfly is having a good time at the moment. He enjoys traveling with us very much. That's excellent. Does Mr. Dragonfly have any ideas where we might... Oh. Oh, we bought logs. So that's where they appear. Okay. All right, then. Uh, we also have wolves. Are these logs ours, or are they just actual logs? Okay, no, they're, they're actual logs. Actual fallen trees. Okay, so I don't see a house, Carl. Although I don't actually know what the limit of my land is here, so... I mean, they call it Lakeside Manor, and it's nowhere near the lake. She's seen me. She has seen me. Yeah, she knows. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thing is, miss. Oh, okay. I don't want to disturb... You know what, actually, though? I don't think that's going to be on my land. 
No, I don't. I know why it's called a lakeside manor. There's the lake. I'm not seeing a house, Carl. I probably have to actually build a bloody house to get a bloody house, Carl. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house. Okay. It's an honor to serve you. Uh, do you have any water? What does a harbor? I'm a thane. What does that F follow me? I need you. Uh, I was. Where, where are you staying, though? Where Where are you? Follow. Just lead on, thane. My blade is always yours to command. Out of. I was just coming back to talk to. Oh. Honored to see you again, my thane. You're not exactly what I was expecting. What do you need, my thane? What does a house call do? Yeah, you don't. As my thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Yeah, but but I okay. Can I leave right, her? Then. Can I leave her at the manor? I was I am your sword. Kinda hoping we could get her to build the bloody house for us. Lead on, Thane. My blade is always yours to command. Yeah, you 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 say that, but you're not actually following me. You're just staring at me. You're not following, you see. I'm I'm a little f What do you need, my thane? I need you to follow me. Lead on, thane. My blade is always yours to command. Okay. And you're not going to Is this cuz I don't have a house? Is this is this Okay, so we need to do the small house layout. Okay, I'm going to create the layout. Okay. Did that do any? Okay. Well, so, okay, so I stand here. I stand here and, and draw the drafts and everything, and you build it to my... Oh, I like that. Yes, no, we could do... We can do that. Carpenter's workbench. Okay. We need nails and quarried stone. Now there's there is there was some quarried stone in here, but there wasn't nails. Damn it. Uh oh. Just new no, new. No. So we're gonna need We're gonna need Armorer's Ingot. We need clay. Well, I don't know whether we need this. We need... We're probably going to need quarried stone. Oh, is there any stone to be quarried around here? We got iron ore. I've got a lot of stone back at home. Oh, there's a pickaxe. I have a feeling... We Traveling alone is boring and dangerous. <sighs> It is nice to have company. Uh, okay, so we've got logs. Have we got a saber cat or was that a boar? I couldn't quite see. Okay, so we got we got logs. We got clay. We got stone. We got not nails. We've not got nails. Oh. <sighs> Let's just go see what they've got at the local shops. Probably should have checked there beforehand. I tell you what, poor bloody Shadowmere and Sweet Roll are getting one hell of a workout today. We're back and forth and back and forth. Hammered copper pot. Why do I get the feeling I need that? Probably because I do. You don't have any nails, though. That's unfortunate. You did have a book that I needed. The one that needed. Steal wanted. anything from my shop and you'll regret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah. Regret, regret. Okay, so no nails to be bought here. This is going to be one of those annoying... <sighs> Where else? I, I'm pretty damn sure the alchemist is not going to... Oh, God, no, don't stab people. I know you're irritated. Okay. Men and women joined a war. They travel far on these roads. 
You don't have anything for Blades, sale, right? Helmets. Not that Pretty I need. Much anything to suit your needs. Specifically nails. You, I want nails, and you don't actually have nails. You do, once again, have some rather nice stuff. Oh, I'm going to take that. I don't know if I need it. Armourers, ingots, I might need. I, I mean... <sighs> All right, the other thing, then, is... Can I get you to make... Well, if you say so. I've got a bunch of nails back at the museum, but I'm not traveling all the way to the museum just to pick up uh, nails. Right, what would it come under? We've got hinges. Am I going to need hinges? I'm probably going to need hinges. You know what? Why don't I just ask you to build a bunch of stuff? Right, let's build all the nails. And then the next time I come back here, it's costing me a fortune, but there you go. And, uh, Oh, let's, let's make a couple of locks. Maybe some iron fittings and hinges, just in case. So I'm now a Thane from Riften across to Falkreath, up to Markarth, and all the way to Solitude. I pretty much am a Thane on the sort of outer area of Skyrim. The, the only real coasts I've not got covered at the moment are the east and the north, which probably is where I want to focus next. I cannot help but feel I've not finished. I don't have a home here in Falkreath. I'm a Thane without a property, which feels wrong. But I'm going to have to wait until the nails are ready or until I can come back with some more nails that I've got stored in uh, in the museum. I could do that, of course. I could go back to Solitude and then just take a carriage here. I, I may do that. However, I've got to get back to civilization, so to speak. They don't actually have a bloody carriage here. That's the problem. So I've got to go back to get a carriage wherever I go. And my, my plan was to actually go via Markarth because I really do want to investigate Arkham's. There is the forge there and I cannot help but feel that would be an excellent find for our museum. Yes, I do. And then I will head back on the correct horse. I will head back to uh, the museum and see how the Explorers Guild are getting on with their various plans. Why is there a, an Imperial? Okay, never mind. He's just hanging around, staring at the town like he's wondering whether he should go in or attack it. There are a few paths going to where I need to go, but I'm not totally sure this is one of them. I think it goes back. I, I probably need to go one further and then just keep going up past Dushnik Jarl. Yeah. I still haven't figured out if those uh, orcs there would be friendly. Mind you, it's now the middle of the day. Could actually be a good time to find out. It's always good who, who the hell? What? That's... Just keep going! I was about to say, it's always good to know who is and is not hostile. Although, I have to say, the people who are hostile... Oh, no, I... Oh, god damn. The people who are hostile normally are... A little more obvious. Yeah, we need to go... Right, you know what? We're going to have to deal with this guy, or... All right, let's just, just... Oh, God. Go, run past him. We're not trying to beat you. Who are you? What are you doing? Is it an elf? It's not even... Oh, God. Hey, have we... Who the hell was that? Was it one of these? Is he still following us? Just give me a second. Who the hell was that? He's, he's following us. He's actually following us. Oh. Alright. 
Oh, God. Can I... Uh, oh, there's no way to get to here. Oh, God. I'm... No! Oh, okay. Ah. Oh, God. Okay, that's, that's nice. That's nice. What? Who was this person? And uh, why... Okay, not really for me, but may, may, maybe there's a place for it in the... <laughs> what an odd person. I, I found his outfit a little distracting. I'm finding that even more distracting. Are we... Are we... Okay, the horses... Sweet roll! What is it with... Okay. Yeah, poison. <sighs> I am just... Necessary. Ooh. Uh, sweet roll, if you could possibly stay there. Stop running away quite so much. I wish I could sort of tie the horses together. This was not the right way, was it? I don't think so. This leads up to... Reach Cliff Cave. No, we want to just keep going until we see Dushnik Val and then just go round it. Yeah, that high elf. At first I thought it was just another uh, Reachman, not another Forsworn. But then I saw the out. Well, it was actually the outfit kind of matched the whole Forsworn thing. But then I saw his face and thought, wait, there are no high elves in the Forsworn, are there? I mean, I wouldn't have thought so. And there is... Dushnik Val. I'm thinking... Orcs are very stern. Yeah, but they're not shouting at us. They're not shouting at us. Do they sell nails? Is it possible they might sell nails? They're craftsmen. After all, hello. I'd like to know. Hello? Hello? Hi. I was... What is he wearing? Never mind. Hello, marble. I... Orc poisons are to be feared if you wish to trade. Ooh. Dude, I'm... I'm... A yes. Ah. So you're an alchemist, then? Yes, I am. Uh, let's have a look what you've uh, got in the way of... You've got rabbit haunch. Do you have... No, you don't have um, glow dust, which is unfortunate. Do you... Silver side... But those are... I can't remember if those are the... S no, it's River Betty. It's River Betty that's the... T you know what? I'm just buying all your fish. I used to wander the corners of Skyrim like you. I miss those days. Okay, so you don't make any... You miss traveling? I do. There's a freedom the roads give you that the stronghold does not. But I have a place here, and I wouldn't want to dishonor my clan by leaving again like some young pup. No, absolutely. Why don't you travel with me? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, yes, no. I'm sorry. I'm just looking All right, then. for uh, the people who might be selling things. This is the kind of place uh. where men are men, and so are the women. Dude, are you trying to get us killed? Forgive, forgive me. He's he he's he's a Khajiit. Uh, you need steel? Speak to my forge wife, Garo. Wait. You sent me a letter, didn't you? Thanking me for killing your rival. Oh yes, you did. Yes, you did. Yep. Now our business together is done. Yeah, I'm still not completely. That was. Was it a rival? Or was it... No, it wasn't it because I killed the bard? I can't remember. Okay, you know what? Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I'm, I'm looking for people who are making things. I'm... I'm... Okay, I'm hearing craftsmen. Craftsmen! I worked the no. forge with my mother, Garl. That's nice. We mine our own ore and shape our own metal. Garl! 
Are you looking to work? Do you trade weapons the are with the cities? You bring me ore, I'll give you coin. No, no, no. Um, oh, your weapons and armor are impressive. It is said that an orc first learns to wield a hammer in her mother's womb. My tradition. That would be kind of painful. Always teaches her children how to smith. If a chief has a second wife, she is called the forge wife in honor of this. Okay, that's really, really... Do you trade weapons with any of the cities? I'm not sure why I'm interested, but I am all of a sudden. Occasionally. But an orc blade is a very personal thing. Anger, well. regret, pride. All these things are put into our steel. When my daughter Lash chose to leave the stronghold, I forged a sword to channel all my shame and grief. Honor me with a task, Outlander. Bring the sword to my daughter if you see her. It'll be all she needs to know. Where? Oh, yeah, sure. Give me the sword. Is it? Is it a good sword? Thank you. Okay. Right. Uh. Yeah. Uh, actually, I was wondering if you had anything for sale. Mm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Uh, I'm right looking for nails. Nails, na you don't have nails. You don't have nails, so you don't have anything to suit my needs, unfortunately. You do have glacial crystal ingot, so I'm buying that. Okay, Garrel's Iron Sword is, um... Well, it's kind of crap. Um... If we see this lash person, I will be gladly handing it over. I mean... Ah, oh, that is where we're going. Maybe, uh... You know, maybe it earns me a little favor with someone, because otherwise it's, this is just a bloody iron sword, and the last thing I need is an iron sword. Now, when we were last here... I was, uh... The are we in the right pl are we in the right place? Yeah. When I was last here, I was uh feeling tremors. Yeah. That's a little uh How do we get up there? The, the stairs are there, but I'm not seeing a way to the stairs. Oh. There. Right. Oh. Yeah, that is very worrying. And then we heard a voice inside. Yes. Oh, tell you what. I'm just going to leave some stuff on the horse. Okay. A little lighter. Just in case we find some stuff in there. And, uh, I'm kind of hoping we do. Right. Oh. It just occurred to me. The orc stronghold back there had an alchemy bench. I should probably use the alchemy bench and get a bit better prepared for this. I've got a lot of potions I need to sell as well. So, I want night eye. Yeah, we'll go with that one, the weaker one. That will last for a while. But what else? Regeneration of health. Good. Resisting fire. I knew I had regenerate stamina ones, but they're called carry weight. Oh, that's actually not bad as well. Although it only lasts for, well, it lasts for quite a while, but not long enough to get me back to Markarth. So, yeah, I'm still going to take one. I think that's everything I absolutely need. Uh, oh, God. Is good to oh. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, I, I, yes, I wasn't meaning to whistle. I was a bit... Caught out by my uh, by my own uh, night eye. So yes, right, bit better prepared. Some fortification on my resists, my um, sneaking, and of course having the ability to see a little better in the dark. Okay, third times 
a charm. Oh, it is dark. Right. So the last time we came here, we did... We did receive some friendly advice. Okay, my dagger is... Doing... W okay. I'm feeling a little psychedelic right now. Okay, that is really annoying. Uh... Oh, I have a feeling I've, uh, I've overdone it with the, the, the potions and poisons and things. Uh, yeah, as I was saying, I, uh, did receive a little friendly advice last time I was here, and that advice was, go away. Now, I'm hoping that, uh, the person who gave us that advice will not be terribly upset with us for ignoring her. She didn't sound, you know, the unpleasant type. It wasn't like, you know, the Patima, Patema type thing. It was more like a, I don't know, it felt like a friendly warning. Okay. I have this urge to s to not get crushed. I have this urge to stay in the shadow, but I also have another urge to stay at the edge, which means I've got conflicting urges right now, and it's sort of confusing me. Hello? Um... We're, um... We're, 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 we're not here to do... anything bad. We're, um... We're archaeologists. We're, we're here trying to find a forge... to, to advance... Oh, God. You know, to advance... learning and understanding and stuff. We're very nice. We really are. Yeah, that's, uh... Okay, that is dead. That is good to know. Yeah. I am getting weirdly distracted by my own dagger. Okay, there's some sort of arch ahead. How dark is it? Oh my god. Yeah, that that's that's pretty damned. Duh is Is that a Falmer thing? Can't quite tell. Oh, stairs. Okay, this place is falling apart. Oh, there you are. You know, I can't help but feel that this helpful person who's telling us to go away is probably giving us exceptionally good advice. Why are we here, really? The forge. Yes, I know. I know, I know, I know. Okay. I'm not hearing any, uh, I don't know, sounds of Falmer or the Dwemer constructs. Although that could just be because I thought I saw a body over there. It could just be because they've all been crushed by falling stones. 
which doesn't exactly fill me with... But, okay, we... What are you still doing here? Uh... Let me guess. You're here for the treasure, aren't you? Just like all the others. Uh, mm, wait. There is treasure, then? It's a long story. You ever heard of Ethereum? A rare mineral used by the dwarves. Yes, I have. Supposedly, they had to build a special forge, the Ethereum Forge, to even work with it. Yeah. The items it made were so powerful, they went to war over it, and the forge was lost. Yeah, that's... Or so the story goes. That's why we're here. Uh, yes, and the story led you here? It led me here, too. I'm, I'm hoping to not, you know, follow your footsteps much further, I think. I spent my life tracking down that legend until my damn apprentice stole everything from me and published it all under his own name. And now, now I can't rest. Not until I have proof. Something to show the world what I discovered, what I did, that my life mattered. But it's hopeless. I died here, just like all the others. Turn back. Turn back before you become the next victim. Yeah, they... Okay, I can handle myself. I don't give up. I can handle... Believe it or not, we, we can actually handle ourselves really well. It, you, it may surprise you looking at me, but this is not my first time doing this. I wish I could stand up right now. I, we're actually pretty damned good at this whole relic hunting thing, surprisingly enough. Um, yes, we, we can handle ourselves. <laughs> Maybe so. Then again, I thought I could too. Good point. I'm not going to talk you out of it, am I? Well, you, I know. you could try. I, I was just like you once. Well, if you want to reach the summit, you're going to need some help. You want a hand? Uh, yes. Yeah, uh, yes, definitely. All right. Lead on, then. Oh. Oh, you... Oh, I, I thought by hand you were going to give us some information, or... I don't know. Help along the... I, you're you're going to follow? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm... It's... It's just that you're a little, um... I don't know. How, how can I uh, put this politely? Conspicuous. Like, I'm pretty damn sure, even without night eye... In fact, you know what? Especially with night... Oh, my God, I can't see anything but you now. Well, you know what, though? You've probably got a lot of useful information about this place. Now, was there... I'm assuming we have to get across... there. Right. I'm not actually seeing... Oh. Okay, I'm seeing dead Falmer, and I'm also seeing a way down. This is where I ended up. It was quite the fall. Oh. Grab my journal, would you? We're going to need it. Oh, this is... this is... this is you. Oh. That's machinery, right? So this is... this... You're remarkably well preserved. When did you... die? Never mind. Um... Ooh. Do you mind if we take, like, other stuff as well, you know? I've read this. In fact, I think... Isn't this the one that... I think this is the one that actually led us... He... Oh. Okay. That is an archaeological... dig. Oh, what? I'm... Okay. What is that? 
and uh, Falma Axe. I don't think we need a Falma Axe or a shield for that matter, but I can't quite remember. I'll, I'll double check that la later. Can we? Come, come. Oh, come. Ah, what is that? Centurion Dynamo Core? I think I've already found one, actually. But you know what? It's... Shh. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, I'm not stuck. I'm not stuck. I... Oh, please don't fall. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. What's that? Oh. Right, there's, there's going to... Could, could, could I get a... Oh, maybe if I stamp. Yeah. Could I get a bit of a hand here? Maybe? Just... What? Okay. Where is... It? Hello, Inigo. Um... I'm just... I'm just... Going to investigate that, and then, and then we should read the journal. Yes. Yes, we absolutely sh Okay! Um... Ha oh, can we... get over there? Probably not. Do I have to swim over there? You know, this whole archaeology thing is a lot less intellectual than I thought it was going to be, and a lot more, you know, well, getting wet and disgustingly dirty. Did I see something? I thought I saw something in the... Okay, right, I'll tell you what, why don't I read the journal and... Uh, journal, Katria's. 17th of Sun's Height. Damn that scheming elf. Damn him. He steals my notes, my discovery, and publishes it under his name. 20 years of my life spent digging through these, those ruins, and what do I get? A dedication. Friend and colleague, my arse. He's just mocking me. Well, I'll have the last laugh. Taron may have my theory, but he doesn't have any proof. Not yet. If I can find the forge first, I can show the world this is my discovery. Mine, not his. His Taron. Is that the is that the author of the book we read? It probably is, isn't it? Okay. Fourth of last seed. I've got a lead. One of the mouldy old books in Mzund mentioned the forge. Ruined through and through, but I was able to copy down a few scraps, including a map of the first era Dwemer Kingdoms. Need to cross-reference it with modern borders when I get back. Here's the result. Argon thanks. This one, Argon Thams, was on the inscription too. Apparently the main Ethereum research centre. Seems like the place to start. Two, mentioned as a Bathazel allied city. Not Bathar Dams, though. Looks like a smaller site. North or northwest of there on the river. Three, the primary source of Ethereum extracted from some deeper mine. Four, a storage site for raw Ethereum just outside a major city. Apparently, it had to be kept outside because the Ethereum was harmonically volatile. Harmonically volatile. Is that going to be important? No name, no identifying information, but page after page of ruined diagrams. Couldn't make out much, but it looks like an astrolabe. A gear, some sort of crest in four pieces. Could this be the location of the forge? Something important, at least. 22nd of last seed. Argenthams. My map may be rough, but it was enough to get me here. There may be something to this after all. Oh. I have a feeling this is going to be important. 23rd of last seed. Reached the treasury. There's a tonal lock here. Still active, judging from the corpses. It's safe to say that the traps are still active too. Couldn't find any clues, so I'll make a sketch and work through this carefully. Five resonators, five tones... Just have to hit them in the right order. Let's see. One, two, okay. So she. All right. And I don't quite get that one. That one's not two, that one's not two. So she got one first time. Second one she got eventually. The one underneath is not three. I think. I think that's what she's saying. All right, probably that will make a lot more sense at some other moment in time. Right now, it's telling me very little 
and it's certainly not helping my current predicament. Uh, please don't do that. You make me nervous. Yeah, my, my current predicament is how the hell to get there without getting soaking wet. This is probably going to be easier to do without a torch in hand, right? Okay. Oh. God. Just... I, I can't get up on the rock. I do hope that was not as embarrassing as it felt. What are you two doing? Where are you... Uh... Okay. Whoa! All right. Never mind. Oh. Was there, a, was there a cool way to do that? Does not look like a cool way. No, it does not. That looks like a way to absolutely ensure broken legs. So. More Dwemer constructs. And... Yeah, I, I keep expecting these to sort of jump back to, uh, I, I guess life is the the wrong word. What is she doing? You know what? Never mind. What, no, what, no. what did I hear? What did I hear? I heard... Bzzz. Now I'm hearing another weird sound. And Inigo's gone for a swim as well. Okay then. Um, you guys have fun. I'm just going to, uh... See, I told you I was an archaeologist. I'm doing archaeologist stuff. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Your legs are too tired? Okay, dude. Your legs are tired? Really? To be honest with you... I didn't think much tired you out. No, I didn't. Right. Oh, can we? Well, we can, but it won't achieve anything. Oh. There's no... I'm just... I'm never making that, am I? I'm not. No, I'm not. Well, I'm already bloody wet, I suppose. Oh. And then... I did... No... Okay, I, I'm... Why am I stuck? What? In a, I'm... St in a, in a go? I'm... I'm... St I'm stuck under a pipe! In a go, I'm stuck under a pipe! In a go! I'm... St Please help! 